Ken Livingston is under attack tonight for presenting a programme on Iranian state television. Mr Livingston, Labour's candidate in the next year's mayoral election, is reviewing books. His spokesman defends the move, saying a wide range of people from different backgrounds have appeared on the channel. The full story now from our political correspondent, Simon Harris. He's the former mayor hoping to make a political comeback, but Ken Livingston leads a double life. When he's not campaigning to get his old job back, he earns a living as a broadcaster. And his latest foray into the world of television has landed him in familiar territory at the centre of a row. Hello and welcome to Epilogue, Press TV's book review show. I'm your host, Ken Livingston. Yes, Ken Livingston is working as an anchorman for Iranian television. I'm Ken Livingston and this week I'll be joined by two excellent studio guests. The former mayor presents a book review for Press TV, an English language channel linked to Iran's state-controlled broadcaster. I think it's a terrible lack of judgment on the part of Ken Livingston to be uh, in the pay of Iranian state-sponsored television. The same television station, Press TV, that has been condemned by human rights activists uh, across the world, actually. And I think it just shows that uh, this is a man who's not in the political mainstream in this country. Tonight, a spokesman for Ken Livingston said, a wide range of people of different backgrounds in politics, academia and other walks of life have appeared on the channel and this is an occasional book review. By working for Press TV, even, even in his capacity as it's reported as a book reviewer, it, it validates the views of, uh, of Press TV. Um, and I think is entirely inappropriate for someone who aspires to he is the candidate to become the Mayor of London. Today we'll be looking at a book by Amna Daru Badran. When London Tonight told a Labour Party official about the Mayor's Iranian TV work, the response was, you are joking. Simon Harris, London Tonight. And this week I'll be joined by...